Good afternoon, viewers. Welcome back to the channel. I, of course, am Birdman Johnson, and you might have noticed this is not the Dwarf Fortress Alpha. No, we are back here in Goose Paddled. Uh, the Alpha keeps crashing on me after about three minutes of recording, so until I get that worked out, hey, we're back in the Goose Fort. You know, that's not necessarily a bad thing, right? Now, I don't remember... Cool, we're getting a mood. I don't remember what we were doing last time. <laughs> Uh, so currently, we're making blocks, we're cutting a bunch of rock, and we're making some coffins. That's new. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and build some burial chambers up here on this goose level, even though we have no dead of any kind. Um, at least according to this thing. <laughs> and I can't find any coffins anywhere, so we're, we're gonna we're gonna build some burial chambers for the dwarves. Okay, it's kind of crafting shop, although maybe those should go, like, here. Maybe that would be a better place for the dwarves. And then we can reserve this for goose burial. I don't know, we'll figure it out. So looking at our military, we have three squads that we haven't really used yet. The thing is... What is this? This is just a thing. All right. If we look at the nearest settlements, um, they are unpopulated forest retreats. There's a goblin forest retreat, but there's not a lot going on out here. Um, I think we can safely blame the goblins for this. Oh, cobalt forest retreat. And there are some elves. So I think that once we get a few more dwarves here, because currently we're at 91 citizens. I think once we get up to like 120, we'll start dispatching squads to occupy some of these sites. I'm also continuing to improve the prison ice tower here. <clears throat> we have no prisoners and are unlikely to have any in the near future, but we're going to have lots of room to put them in once we get them. We've got a lot more soldiers than we need for what's happening here. Also, I like how you can tell that there's still no floor here. It says there's floor. Maybe that's just the texture of the uh, still. I don't remember. We're set for food, though. Okay. What time of year is it? It's late winter. Spring, so we might get an elven caravan. I won't be surprised if we don't. Just checking out the map here, because it's been a long time since I've looked at this. Since the day the last episode went up, actually. No, yeah, there goes our Mood Dwarf. He's doing something. Okay. Oh, oh, has begun a mysterious construction. Fantastic. Still got some eggs, although we are still in that position where we have too many geese, so it won't let us breed anymore. Uh, unless I miscounted, we're currently at 159 geese. So hopefully we'll be able to get some more from incoming caravans. Uh, stockpiles are looking great. This fort is doing very well. And I think it would behoove us to make some more tables and chairs for these areas. Right, why do we just have tables here? Probably because this is a guild hall. <laughs> yeah, it's somebody's guild hall. Hunter's Guild, maybe? Dunno, don't care. Our library. Noble rooms currently being used for storage because we only need so many bedrooms right now. In fact, the only real noble that we have is the mayor, who is right here. Maffle. Is that you? Yep, that's Maffle, the mayor. Maffle named Lance. Currently not doing anything. Um, you are actually a warrior, so that's good to know. 
but we can assign you to lead the uh, Fortress Guard. Which we don't have. Can I assign Maffle? Sure can. <laughs> there we go. Why not? And then... Uh... Oh yeah, Shelmets. I forgot about Well, no, that's no good. Um, no, the Shelmet is fine. There's going to be a little bit of learning curve here. I'm crying out loud. Okay, I want to assign, equip, assign uniforms. Shelmet. There we go. Fantastic. Now then, over here, the workers of wire. We're going to look for basically anyone with a weapon skill. And we have a ton of hunters for some reason. Or not even a weapon skill, just a combat skill. Yes, good. A pump operator. A fine choice. Since we're unlikely to ever use pumps here. Okay, well, then we'll just grab uh, a glazer and an extra trader that we don't need. Great, okay, now we have those. Let's see, we do need some steel stuff. some shell helmets. Do we have any shells, though? Is that under body parts or remains? It's under bones? Oh, no. Too many blocks. The game's freezing. Okay. Yeah, shells. Okay, great. So let's make some more shell leggings, shell gauntlets, and shell helms. Great. And then how are we set for steel? We have a lot of it. All right, cool. Uh, steel breastplates, steel um, high boots, right? Steel shields. Want steel short swords. Yeah, it's probably fine. Oh yeah, we can make some leather mittens, right? Yes, we can. Leather cloaks. Okay, there, that should do us. Well, this is very business as usual for our first time back in this fort. Uh, we are gradually getting everything built. Why? I feel like, given the number of dwarves here, maybe these things should be happening faster. I don't know. Is there anything worth taking from any of these areas here? Uh, no, that's populated, so we're going to ignore that. Okay. It looks like everywhere with anything to steal is populated, so we're just going to uh, ignore all this for the time being. Oh, <laughs> we're not messing with that. Ah, uh, hell slips. I forgot about hell slips. Spider curled. That's right, we took over Malign Seduced. <laughs> Worked menaces. And there's Verse Tomb. Population 600. What happened? What happened there? I don't recall authorizing that. There's nothing up in the north, is there? No, I think we are the furthest thing north. Okay. 
This is going to be an all dwarven planet pretty soon. At least if we have our way. Uh, yeah, we've already mined out all of that. Let's see, what were you? You were a goblin of some kind. I, I don't remember what happened. There are a few dead goblins, so obviously we did get a siege that I just forgot about. <laughs> okay, dokie. Right, no cage traps. That's one of the rules for this. Okay. We need a project, and I don't just want to build more walls. We need more geese is what we need. Right, okay, so that artifact's done. Uh, Zuthan Avuzikast, the peasant, has created Kalreth Zixis, a dogbone door. She claims it is an heirloom in the name of the family ancestor, Alath Washtrim. Let's take a look at that. A dogbone door, 12,000 dwarf bucks. A dogbone door, encrusted with oval shale cabochons, decorated with elephant leather an alpaca wool, and encircled with bands of dogbone and rectangular shale cabochons. That is fine. You didn't do a bad job. I guess we'll stick that... Um, here, the mayor can have that. The mayor can have that here. What the... Okay. As you were. Okay, this wasn't quite what I was expecting to deal with today, but apparently the dead are walking. So, um, let's call everybody inside. I don't remember what else needs to happen. <laughs> Uh, those are not all zombies. The Thrun's soldiers, of course. We all remember Thrun's soldiers. Um, I don't remember where the lever is. Let's pause the game. It's one of these, yeah? Did I identify these? No, of course not. Okay. Okay, well, this one does not link to any of those. So we're going to pull those and pull that. Is everybody inside? Doesn't actually matter because we've got lots of ways in. So go ahead and close the, the gates there. Okay. Maybe? Yes, good. Okay. Where's the enemy? Right there. They're gradually making their way in. Now, if I am not very much mistaken, I'm guessing that this lever right here will raise all of those bridges. Yes, okay. Why is that already? Oh, right, because that's linked to those. Okay. All right. So then, stand down. We will allow the enemy to approach. That, that is a lot. That is an awful lot of undead. Many of them are intelligent. This is not ideal okay now oh, look at that one of them's already climbed up on top did I leave a staircase down there I did not how did you get up there did you just climb okay well we have we do have a marks for well, the crafts of distinguishing yes B there we go okay Grab some bolts and post up over there. We're going to see if maybe you can get some shots off on these undead. Do any of you have bolts on you? You've got a quiver. Is there anything in it? Kind of seems like our archers, well, crossbowmen, may not have picked up any ammunition to go with their quivers. 
Okay. Do we have ammo for them? Yes, quite a bit, in fact. Look at that. It's even here, inside the fort. Did I make a mistake here? Do I need to, like, assign Archer? No? Hmm. Doesn't seem like I need to manually assign them ammunition. So why, pray tell, did you not pick any up? Okay. Uh, what shall we do about this, team? Here come the rest of them. This is not gonna go great for us if we just try to roll out there and fight them, I think. Oh, that's so many! <laughs> Look at them all! Disasters of Night! Disaster of Night, Creature of Agomenol, Night's Catastrophe, Creature of Natural Mirror, Odom Kogan's Disaster, Zubengepsu's Mistake. I'll say, I'll say it's a mistake. Look at them all. This is terrible. Um, well, they will, of course, massacre our livestock, who I will just go ahead and release from the pasture. So that they can flee for all the good it will do. Okay, see, the entire reason... Um, okay, the entire reason we built these is so that our crossbow squads would have places to stand and shoot. So maybe if we just stockpile some ammo here, okay, here, Here, <laughs> just kind of everywhere that we might tell them to stand and shoot, right? We seem to have a bunch of ammo, so let's use it, team. Okay, that should happen like immediately, right? We're all gonna help carry bolts, yes? Well, some of them are. Curious to see where they go. Well, of course, they're going to beeline for the livestock. Such as it is. You know, the half dozen random animals that we've got standing outside. Run! Go on, little peafowl. A blue peacock named Distant Spear. Go ahead and flee. There you go. You are not a goose, but that does not make your life unprecious. And, oh, hey, they can shoot. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, good. The monsters have crossbows. Crossbows? Oh, look at all that stuff. Okay. Yeah, what are you armed with? You, perhaps? Yeah, crossbows. Great. That's wonderful. Okay. Okay, well, the um, ammo stockpiles are getting filled. So that's good. Let's... Dispatch them. Now that there are bolts there in the, the, the shooting area here, they're a sniper nest, if you like. Perhaps now you can shoot? Hmm? No? You don't want to? Interesting. Okay. What if I just designate a target? Does that help? Like, you're on the same level as them. No?
come. Okay. I think they might have killed our livestock. Uh, pfft, I don't know. Okay, that's where all the front soldiers are. Everybody else is still making their way down. What are we going to do about this? Uh, I think what we will do... I think what we will do... Let's move all the dwarves... All the fighters here. Okay. And then what we will do... Danger. So we're going to open this. Okay. Actually, there's no need for a now order on that. These are going to open, right? And this right here, I think you can see my cursor, is going to open. And that should attract them. They should walk to that, and I bet we can get just a few of them inside. And I'm going to ensure that this works by locking the others. So that's their only way in. So we'll get just a few of them in here, okay? Just a few. Does anybody want to come in here? Look, there's an open door. The game is lagging slightly. Okay, we got plenty of dwarves there. Oh, oh, I think they're doing it. I think they're cooperating. Now, not too many of you. But more than one, please. We might have too many dwarves stacked up in the corridor. We're going to find out. We are going to find out. Yeah, gee, that's a lot of guys. That's so many undead. Okay, first one's in. I would love it if they were a little more clustered up. Okay, he has reached. Good, we can see the rest of them coming. Okay, the first two have reached the combat area. The dwarves are moving in. Ideally, oh good, they're going down. Ideally, we'll just drown them in numbers here. Okay, here comes another one. We need to be ready on the trigger here. Because if too many of them get in here at once, it's going to be a big, big problem. I think, I assume, I don't know. I don't even need to raise the gates, I just need to lock the door. Okay, once that group here gets in... Oh, wait, we can't lock the door, obviously, because the enemy has seized it. Yes? Yes. Okay. Ready? Ready? If they can move a little bit faster, just give me a few more frames here. Have we lost anybody yet? We have not. Weight of numbers is doing its job. Actually, at the rate they're trickling in, we might be able to handle this. Okay. Wait for it. They're not... Okay, they're turning away. They're turning away. Why are they doing that? Stop it. Oh, they had to attack that guinea pig. What is that doing? What is happening here? Where... Is there a guinea pig? No, it's dead now. Okay. <laughs> or cavey, pardon me. Whatever, meets meat. Okay. Carefully, carefully, carefully. Let's... You know what? Let's just order this pulled, and I think however many get inside is going to be just fine. Check back up here where we are winning. Okay, the lever's pulled. Okay. 
just have a few of them here to deal with. This is going to be a tedious way to win this, but it will work. Okay, they're all redirecting somewhere else. Y'all yeah, just hang out there in the corridor and let them come to you. What was that? Hive toppled. Hive toppled. They're knocking down our beehives. Where are our beehives? I forgot we had beehives. Okay, well, they're knocking them all down, so we're just going to have to build new hives. Oh, they're over there. There we go. They've knocked down all of our hives. They have released all the bees. <laughs> are you sure that's what you want? Okay, have we killed all of them that are inside? I think we have. Okay, do it again. Oh, Peacock's dead. <laughs> A uh, dead horse. I, I imagine, right, that all the animals that were outside are now dead. Yeah, there's a mangled bull corpse. Uh, the game has sped up slightly, so that's interesting. Okay, let's get a few more. Come on, come on. That was a now order. Not a... wait, what? Oh, pardon me, it is down. I'm just not paying any attention. Stop knocking over... Ugh, they're breaking everything. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Those are decorative. Here we go. More of them are coming up. Mobbed and dead. Well, we have wounded. I'm not sure I care, to be honest. Protect the geese! Fight! Kill! Yeah, I think we might be about to start taking some casualties here. Oh, this is so many. I don't think I want to make you watch me fight all these. Back to your post, back to your post, don't get spread out. Okay, here comes another cluster, we're gonna trap these. We'll make sure to get a few of them in here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Faster! Faster! Where's Logan Labor Conjures when you need him? He better not migrate. We're in a completely different civilization. Why are they moving away? <laughs> Get in here. Come on, come on, come on. Not too many at once. Although if we can squish some with the bridge, that would be incredibly helpful. Oh, somebody died. Is somebody pulling this? Somebody else died. Okay. Oh, okay. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> that was the mayor. The mayor died. All right. Um, congratulations, Fickod the Hammer Dwarf. Armorer. Oh, good. We got a new mayor right away. Peasant. Gate, please. Gate, please. Thank you. All right, I'm not going to make you watch this whole thing. Stand by, folks. We'll check back in in a minute.
Despite my best efforts to keep the dwarves inside, they have, um... <laughs> they have left the safety of the tower, so I guess we're committing to this now. Alright, everybody out. Let's go. Um, the good news is we are paring them down very quickly. These goblin zombies, it turns out, are not terribly strong. We have suffered more casualties than I would have liked, but not as many as I was expecting. So I think this will actually be over in just a moment. Yeah, look at that. Wow. Okay. It was really just the Thrun soldiers that were the problem then. Well, go on. Also, for some reason, they keep climbing down here. <laughs> I don't know. We gotta, we gotta figure that out. Are you done over there yet? All of you could kill that right there. Like, what is the problem? Look, it's already mostly dead. Just finish it off. Somebody pound its skull in. There we go. All right. No, you ain't done yet. Go. Finish. <laughs> Look at that. They just wood chipper their way through him. He was just the special ones that were the problem. Okay. What else we got left? Oh, they're actually fighting one right now. I just couldn't see it through all the dwarves. Okay, there. I think we got it. We got a couple of Thrun's soldiers left there and there. Let's see how they managed to get here. No, oh, yeah, they're all standing. Interesting. Yeah, they're getting hungry and thirsty. All these dwarves just standing around, I guess. Okay, well, they're all standing on top of it now. Um, yep, they're all in the same spot. Neat. You couldn't think of any better way to do this, huh? Okay, hang on a sec. How did they get there? Okay, hang on. Open, open all the, open all the things. Open all the things. Open everything. Maybe we need some civilians as bait. How did you get there? Um, okay, we'll have you post here. Okay. How did you get up there? We'll have you over here. Okay. Two of you in the middle. All right. They're shooting at us. And what we're gonna do, well, no, let's wait for the soldiers to get in position. Yeah, I bet he's dead. They're shooting at us and we can't return fire because our Mark's dwarves won't pick up bolts yeah, bone carver. Sounds good. We'll carve some bones. Get on inside. Hip, hip. Come on. What are they doing? They're making their way over there. I think they're confused by the enemies they can't reach. Oh, what? How did you get there? Why is there... How did you get there? What is happening? Now there's a soldier out there, too. I think that baby just got all its teeth smashed out. Okay. Deconstruct. Deconstruct. Go. Do. Slay. We got a dwarf over here. Um... Deagle the Recruit, uh, currently fighting a Thrun's soldier all by himself. 
And somehow, our stone crafter, who has enraged at all enemies, has made his way down here to fight this other Thrun soldier. I don't understand what's happening right now. Okay, well those two... Now we have two of them out there. How are you getting there? Oh, hey, that one's down. Oh, they killed the baby. Look, there's a dead guy over here! Stop! Stop climbing out on the ledges! How are you even doing that? I'm not telling you to do that. Okay, well, I guess we don't need this anymore. Are you gonna... are you gonna win over there? Are you winning? <laughs> Unconscious and exhausted. Yes, they are winning. Okay. Um, I'm gonna need y'all over here. And we're gonna have to deconstruct this window, I guess. Yep, it's just those last two. I guess I better build a staircase out here. Since apparently this is getting... There's another one! Stop it! Oh, you just jumped down? You just jumped on down from there? They can't finish him off. Get over there, go help. This is awful. <laughs> what is happening? Is anybody gonna... No, they probably can't because it's a window and they can see the enemy, so they don't want to go over there. Okay. Alright, you know what, guys? Just... Enough. Enough of this. Hang on a sec. And poof, there they go. Okay, siege over, we win. Good job, team. Who's your rabbit missing? All right, that, I'm done here. We're gonna, we're gonna build some stairs. Is what we're gonna do. Build stairs, okay. Cool. And uh, we're going to check the squads one more time. Everybody's fine. Okay, great. As you were, did the new mayor get assigned his quarters like he was supposed to be? Yes, good. Uh, okay. Okay. Wonderful. I am so happy. This needs to be reassigned. Great. That, that's just wonderful. Okay. I think that's where we're going to call it for today. Hey, folks, thanks for watching. Thanks to those of you who are subscribed to the channel. Thanks to those of you who are not yet subscribed to the channel. And thanks, as always, to those of you watching this without ever intending to subscribe to the channel. This was kind of a weird one. We need to rebuild our beehives. Um, we will be back next week with more Dwarf Fortress, hopefully the Alpha. Horror content on Saturdays. Lots of other stuff on the channel for you to check out. If you have any suggestions for content you'd like to see on the channel, please let me know so I can consider it. And if you yourself have uploaded any Dwarf Fortress content to your channel that you think I need to see, tell me so I can go check it out. All right, we're out of here. Until next week, folks, Birdman out.